One of the big things when I tell people I'm going into a PhD program, it's five years. And so they go, oh, five more years of school. And I'm like, yeah, it's five more years of school. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm okay with that. I'm ready for that. I'm excited about it. Like, I don't think five years of school sounds bad for a career of doing something that I enjoy. When I was in sixth grade, uh, I was taking an earth science class, and I was doing really badly in it, but we started talking about earthquakes, and I got very, very interested. I also had a high school teacher that was very supportive. She had done geophysics when she was in college, and so I had some support system at high school that was very supportive of me going into geophysics, and then I came here as a declared major. I think a lot of my college experience has been made better because I have a lot of really strong geology friends and faculty members. Like, they're faculty members. I've never had a class with them. They know who I am. They know things about me. But it's like, they're all very interested in my success and how I'm doing and things like that. So I just really appreciate having that department that, you know, they're always behind you. You know, they're ready to stand up for you if you need it such a great school for opportunities in terms of making a good student into a great student. I had scholarship opportunities, I had research opportunities that I can guarantee you would not have been available to me at a bigger school. I've had a lot of people recognize the fact that it's unusual for women to go into STEM and that it's really important to keep them here. I want to continue doing research, whether that means I work for a university or a government or a private company. I just want to continue doing research, working with new ideas, things like that.